And hey there guys and gals, this is Omega here. And with a look at the uh, Final Fantasy XIII uh, Lightning Returns uh, demo that just came out uh, in, the, in the US. It came out uh, like last week in the in Japan, or two weeks ago in Japan, but uh, this one just came out in uh, the US for uh, Xbox Live and uh, PlayStation Network. You can get that. It's about 2.2 2 gigs, so it's pretty hefty uh, a demo. Uh, fortunately, it's kind of short. It's about maybe, I want to say, you probably could put in about 20 or so minutes in it. Uh, probably somewhere around 20 or 30 minutes if, if you're just taking your time. But uh, I want to say around there. So, uh, But uh, to kind of show off a little bit of you know the CGI work, which I find really awesome. It looks phenomenal. And this is probably uh, that Luminous Engine <laughs> or whatever they're doing. Uh, for you know, they showed off that trailer I think like last year or two years ago uh, at E3 or was it E3? Yeah, E3. They said they were going to work. This, this is our new, uh, you know, graphics engine for uh, you know our next projects or so. So uh, from the list of it, it's kind of based off of that. Uh, you probably won't see much of that uh, integrated until you know the. The PS4, maybe uh, Xbox One, PC kind of deal. So uh, you won't see that until then. But uh, they kind of, it looks like they kind of made this game look. It just looks a lot better than you know, uh, 13 to uh, not a lot, but it's just a little bit better. But you can tell from you know the facial animations and all that. But that's not what I want to talk about. Uh, like I said, uh, you play the game, but you kind of I don't, really don't know where this starts out with you. Uh, that's where I kind of have. Uh, problem with the demo itself uh they kind of started out kind of just throwing you into the story and you're like oh my gosh what is going on i know it's not the real game but i wish they could have just thrown you into maybe a sequence of battles and you know you know they don't need to tell you a story because when you're listening to it you're like mm, uh, okay so i'm the angel and this is blah, 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 and i'm sent here from god i don't know what the heck's going on <laughs> it's just throwing you with uh, like an, a little open area, ended area, and you can just do the quest and, you know, fight and all that stuff like that. But uh, but when it gets to the fighting parts, uh, you can roam around uh, the battlefield. And uh, not, I should say, before that, uh, you can get attacked by monsters. You know, you hit an R2, and it slashes the enemy, and it, it does, like, status effects to them. Like, in the demo, you can see from there, uh, it does, like... Minus 20% from the, the enemy's HP, so uh, stuff like that. I don't know if later on you'll get more like uh, if you get them, you know, you have different status attacks, like uh, you know, lower their attack or lower their defense a start or something like that. But uh, as far as I see, it, it uh, you know, minus is like 20% from their HP, 15, 10, or something like that. So, uh, but then when you get into battle, you can control lightning with uh, you know with the left joystick uh you can move her back and forth up a uh, forward and back uh left and right uh whatever you want to do with her you can move her around she doesn't move quite fast so she's not like uh you know a tails or a star ocean where you can like make them like run around the battlefield like that so uh fortunately you can't do that but you can kind of move around instead of just having them uh in one little position and that's it like, you kind of move them kind of sway them back and forth uh, then you get your different attacks, you know, triangle, square, X, circle. Uh, square is mostly main f mainly for, like, guarding between different, uh, uh, just guarding attacks. Uh, then, you know, you have your attacks are triangles, uh, X, and circle. I mean, you could, I think you could uh, switch them out, whatever you, whatever you want. So you don't really have to have a guard on there, but uh, from the looks of it, if you want to, you know, negate a few attacks, uh, you know, go ahead. You probably would need that there, but uh, and then you know, attacking them causes uh, things uh, depletes your AP bar, and then which uh, what happens when it empties out is you can't attack. But what you can do when it empties out, and this is the kind of cool part of uh, you know what I like from at least from what I play, what I like from it, uh, to kind of bring the uh, ten two kind of aspect into it, where uh, she has different uh, dresses or. Uh, garbs and stuff like that uh different clothes uh to kind of change her change her, her ability so 
uh, from the demo itself, you have, you know, the the normal attack. You got like a mage type. You got like a dragoon, and uh, and all that. So a red mage, and then you know you could change between you know between three different uh, costumes or suits during battle. Each one has their own attacks. Uh, you can set them up in the uh, settings uh, in your menu and stuff like that. So uh, they don't always have to uh, you know have the same attacks. As the demo, you can you know put in whatever you want to in there, but it takes away from the other, uh, the other, uh, the other, uh, uh, let's say suits. So uh, once you switch out that suit, or once you run out of AP, you switch out that suit uh, to a different one. You get the whole bar back, and then you kind of just burn it and then switch it again. So you got to keep on switching to keep your your AP going, to keep the tag going. Uh, and then you have your staggering, kind of like in what a 10 2 and a 10. This time you gotta have to hit them where it hurts, I guess. So, uh, like in 10, uh, 10 2, you know, you, you cause amount of damage and then it staggers them. This one you have to uh, knock them off balance. You gotta find their weak, weakness to, uh, to attack. Uh, if you find out in, in the, the big dragon battle, uh, you know, that's where you find out, you know, oh, you have to uh, use the jump attack to uh, knock it down. So, uh, stuff like that was pretty cool. Uh, I like, like I said, I did like the battle system. Uh, it's kind of, like I said, they kind of just put all this stuff in there. Uh, what I didn't like about it uh, was the fact that, <laughs> you know, you started out in 10 with a whole cast of characters. And I, I, I admit, there's some of them were pretty useless, but it's just cool to have, you know, a set of characters to kind of play around you know if you want this person you can put in this person even though you know he's not optimal for your team or he or she's not optimal for your team uh, you can do that uh, and then 10 2 you have your two character goal and Sarah and then a monster of your choosing uh, which is okay I guess I'm not a big fan of using the monsters uh, I wish like I said <laughs> you have uh, difference you know just characters you can play with and then uh, lightning returns you have just lightning and herself and your party members are kind of like your 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 suits your dresses and stuff like that so uh you know you switch between them to ch change how you your setup and it changes you know uh the looks of the the armor and the weapons and stuff like that too and, and stuff like that so uh that's the only thing i have a gripe about it i mean i I know a lot of people didn't really care about that, but I'm a big fan of having a cast of characters. I mean, uh, Sword Kingdom 2, the Sword Kingdom series is one of my, you know, favorite <laughs> games, and they have like an over like 100 characters you can you can recruit uh, and solo like, and stuff like that. So, uh, just having different characters would be awesome. Um, I don't know if you'll get them in the game or not. Uh, I think it's right now in Japan, maybe. Uh, so, you know, I haven't. I've done it me. I usually in a media blackout for a lot of games now i uh, don't really want to you know listen or watch things until you know you i actually play it so i get a, a, a good feedback on the game uh but like i said this is just a feedback from the demo uh like i said it's a fairly short demo uh i wish that like i said they could have just done it a, a different demo kind of like the bravery bravery default on uh, demo where they just kind of threw you hey here are these uh, little side quests you had to do uh, you can level up whatever you want to and, and all that. Um, but they kind of have to <laughs> have, kind of go with a story in here, which kind of confuses me more. Uh, so, but I can't knock against that. I'm just knocking against the, the fact that they chose something like that. Um, but, uh, and do, do download the demo because I think you do get a free, uh, a free costume or uh, armor or whatever you want to call it for uh, lightning. So, uh, that will change your appearance. Uh, oh yeah, one more thing before I head off. Uh, you do get a kind of customized lightning too. Uh, you change you change the color of her uh, suits, of her uh, dresses and stuff like that. That's pretty cool. I, I'm a big fan of like stuff like that. You know, having your armor change as you get different armor and stuff like that. Uh, I don't know if you can do that with lightning. Maybe she just has one set and then you can change just that one little item and it just changes her own her own item but she does her weapons and stuff does change her weapon or shield does change so that's the cool that's pretty cool i mean i would like to have different pieces of armor change but you know i'm asking for too much anyway so uh anyways uh hopefully you guys enjoyed the little 
uh, impression of uh, or a little look at uh, Final Fantasy 13. I don't even know why I call it Final Fantasy. I could just call it Lightning Returns. Uh, you know, like I said, go ahead and download a demo. It's a pretty hefty demo. Uh, like I said, it's it's a big demo, but it's kind of short on the side. Uh, there's a lot of stuff you can do. Uh, not a lot of stuff you can do, but there's like network stuff, like online stuff. I don't know what that is <laughs> until the game comes out. Uh, uh, I talked to a lot of those uh, NPCs, and they kind of just was like, oh, you can buy stuff. So I, and it just kept going. But uh, anyways, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Like I said, don't forget to uh, subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to like my video if you guys like it. Uh, hit me up on uh, uh, PSN. My name is Omega Belmont. You can find that in the bottom uh, where the description is and all that. So, uh, anyways, I'll see everybody next time. Peace.